What's going on my fellow residents, it's me the Frozen Cavern and today we're going to continue through our journey of the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the last episode, we finally turned into a grown little boy and that's something I'm going to be catchphrasing throughout this entire journey. So get used to that. And in this episode, we're going to be heading over to Kakariko Village. Now, last episode, I did try to get Epona, but that failed miserably, unfortunately. So I have no idea when uh, the next time I'm going to be able to do that. But let's head over to Kakariko Village and hopefully we'll be able to figure out what we can do from there. Because I do already have the Sun Song, so I don't. I'm pretty sure there's nothing we have to do in the graveyard. Um. What is it that we. Wait, I think the well's dried up right now, but I don't know. Is it? Uh, yes it is. So, I think I'm able to do something here. I don't know if I have to do it yet, but it's a good to... Bomb? Okay, that didn't work. Uh, okay, let's head back out. Actually, this is the one time we're actually going to be... Yeah, I'm already back here. Okay, that was the one time I decided to trust, uh... Nabby and it ended up not working. So... I wonder if I just like have to try and talk around the people. Because I only think certain people would actually know or tell me what to do. Oh wait! I know what I have to do. I almost forgot. I have to go into... Oh wait. It's up here I believe. I have to go into one of these buildings. I have to talk with a certain person. It's inside this building. I have to talk to this guy. Grr. I'll never forget what happened on that day, seven years ago. I'm not doing that noise again. It's all the Ocarina Kid's fault. Next time he comes around here, I'm gonna mess him up. Wanna say that again? You've got an Ocarina? What the heck? That reminds me of that time seven years ago. Back then, a mean kid came here and played a strange song. It messed up this windmill. I love how he's choosing to play this song, even though he said that this exact moment seems somewhat familiar. Also, this is a paradox. Because we have not done this yet. Or at least in terms of Young Link, we have not done this. You've learned the Song of Storms. Oh no, a storm again. You played the ocarina again, didn't you? Yes, yes indeed I did. Alright, so I'm trying to leave. Okay, I was close at least. There we go. Alright, so I think what I'm supposed to do... Either I have to play the song right now, which I don't think is the case. I'm gonna try it anyways. Okay. <laughs> I managed to remember it. Okay, yeah, I don't think this actually does anything. It's not gonna fill the, uh, well at all. And even if it did, we couldn't really do anything. So, I think what we have to do is that we have to go backwards in time and then, um,. Come back to the windmill, and then we play the uh, song because, like I said before, the whole paradox uh, situation. And also, uh, this is well. I mean, this isn't exactly like the biggest place in the world, where the route we're taking isn't exactly that big, so we wouldn't need a pona here. But when it comes to the later parts in the game. Epona is going to be a pretty, pretty good necessity. It's actually pretty crazy. Alright. Now, if I'm wrong about this, then, uh, whoops. <laughs> and I don't know what to do. So, hopefully I am correct on this. Yeah, yeah, I don't care about these things. Alright, so... 
hopefully my idea is correct because we did go back to Kakariko Village. However, I don't know if this is what we have to do. Oh, hi, Sheik. You're still here. To save the forest girl, you need another skill. It's not the Song of Storms, is it? Because I did head back to Kakariko Village. Okay, I'm lost now. Uh, I actually don't know what to do. This is nice. Um... Because I went to Kakariko Village. But I don't know what I'm supposed to do there. Because all I did was get that, uh, song. And honestly, I don't know what else I'm supposed to do. Also, I need to make sure I don't get grabbed by these guys, because they can take out a pretty big, significant part of your health if they ever latch onto you. Uh, this is bad, and I'm... Um, yeah, this is, like, one thing I don't exactly like about this game, is that when it comes in terms of actually making sure you know what to do next, like, completely know what to do next, the game's kind of vague sometimes. Because you're not going to exactly know what to do, which is unfortunate. Alright, so maybe with it being nighttime... Um... Like, I don't know if I have to go into a random building or not, because it said I had to get another skill. Problem is, I don't know what that skill is. I think I can get something from you, I don't know. Please, Witsy, please sell me something. Wait, can I sell you a mask? Oh, I can't wear those. Okay, that's unfortunate. Um, There's too many things of value in here, so... Yeah, I kind of can't do that. And then, not only that, um, I don't think I can sell any of those items. But, this is just for... Wait, no, that's not potions? What is this? Bizarre, open, only... Okay. Well, it's about to... No, time doesn't flow here. Don't remember the song. Hold on. Uh, let me look for it. There we go. Oh, I thought it would actually play. That's unfortunate. Wait. Ah, oh, whatever. There we go. Alright, so let's see if he can actually do anything for us in the daytime. Actually, maybe I talk to these guys, even though that's incredibly vague. Yeah, they're just laughing. Ever since he escaped from Hyrule Castle Town, he's become even more timid. Uh... Oh... Right, I completely forgot about that. I need to go see Dompe. Need to go see his ghost. Whoops! <laughs> yeah, luckily those two people are the only ones there. And, unfortunately, they only appear in the daytime, so... I kind of got completely lucky assuming that talking to people would work. Uh, I have no idea which chest I actually need to use. Uh, it's one of these. It, it's somewhere around here. I'll, I'll just keep searching until I find it, I guess. Okay, that's it? No, okay, that was just... Actually, this one has the patches. I want you to, like, not mess with me, please, while I'm trying to do so. But yeah, I think we have to go in here. Fall down the hole. There we go. Uh, yes. Young man. Da -da -da -da. I'm gonna stop. Are you fast on your feet? I may not look like it, but I'm confident in my speed, but you are, you know, a ghost, so you can fly. Let's have a race. Follow me if you dare. Okay. I don't know how fast I actually have to do this, so... Okay, that's nice. 
Gotta make sure I don't get hit by the fire either. And no, I will not be going for those rupees because I want to do this in time. No? Okay. Okay, good to be hit by that. Somehow managing to mostly avoid the fire. Uh, yeah, he actually did a turn. Okay. Oh, I have to make sure I don't get caught behind those doors either or else I lose. Ah, uh, what? Ah, crud. Okay. Uh, I'm probably gonna lose. No! No, 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 no! Okay, made it. The time of this race was one minute and six seconds. You were very quick to be able to keep up with me. Okay, I made it. As a reward, I'm going to give you my treasure. It's called the hook shot. Now, I think that, um, I could only... I don't know what the time limit is. It might have been a minute and ten seconds, but whatever. It's spring... Yeah, I know how the thing works. I live here now, so come back again sometime. I'll give you something cool. One more thing. Be careful on your way back. That's not suspicious at all. But now we have our brand new power. Or not power, but item. The hookshot. Alright. And this is essentially what we were going to be using in order to get to our uh, next temple. But yeah, it's a good thing that I luckily got over here because, uh, can I get past here? I don't know if I can. What? What are you, what are you locked onto? Oh, that's, I am stupid. Okay, hold on. Uh, wait. Wait. I'm going to look up the sun song again. <laughs> Even though I literally played it earlier. Okay. Alright, but yeah, I have no idea what this thing is all about. Uh, okay, so I can't grab that. Okay, I think I just went the wrong way. Uh... Okay, this is really weird. Hold on. Isn't that the same design that th that's on the door of time? Yes, it is. Wait, does that mean that I have to play the thing for the... Hold on. Uh, Song of Time. Okay, so let's play that. Wait. There we go. <laughs> there we go. But yeah, I'm, like I've said before, I am not an expert on this game, so if it actually does take me a while to do some things, don't kill me. Now's my time to get that thing if I can do this properly. Now, hopefully I can. Go now. I almost messed that up. Oh, gotta be careful. Alright, got the heart uh, piece. Cool. Uh, now I need to head for the exit of this place. There we go. Okay, so now we have the hook shot, and now we have uh, learned the new ability of the Song of Time. So I'm pretty sure that's it. Um, hold on a second. I think I can do something while I'm in here, so let me replace that. Can I go up there? I don't think I can, unfortunately. But, I'm gonna try anyways. Right, I forget that the hook shot is like ridiculously short. You need the long shot. But yeah, I, I have to be on top of that in order for that to work. It is unfortunate, but it, 
Eh, this is just unfortunate. Okay, um... I mean, there's not really much else we can do, so... Or at least I'm hoping there's not much else we can do. So, we're going to leave, and then hopefully... Something will trigger to let me know that I have to go back to the, uh... Forest. Or not, I don't know. Okay, so... All I know is that Sheik said that we have to go to the, um... Forest Girl, and you can pretty much assume who that is because we've only met really one with any form of significance. So we need to head back to Kak not Kakariko, uh, Kokiri Forest. I, for some reason, I keep uh, mashing those two names up. I don't know why, but yeah, if I'm getting this confused or just forgetting this much stuff, like at this point of the game. Oh goodness, and I remember at least one of the uh, temples, like really late temples, it, like going through it isn't really, well, it somewhat is going through the temple and also not. I can't really explain it because, you know, got a friend who's playing it uh, blind beside me, so can't really mention anything about it, so. I like how it started off with happy music and then it ended, oh. Okay, and then uh, went to the um, other thing. Now, uh, hopefully I'm doing this right. Now, if not, once again, I'm sorry. Uh, now I think I have to follow the- I went the wrong way. But, um, I think I have to follow the, uh, music again. What? But that's what- okay. Fine, whatever. Let, let's go a different direction. I thought that maybe I just turned around or something, but no. Okay, I- I- actually, I think here- Yeah, the music just plays indefinitely, no matter where you go, so... You almost somewhat have to know where you're going. Oh, right, uh, I can open up this way, since I'm here. There we go. There we go. Alright, so I'm gonna keep that open for later. But for right now... Wait, that's not the way. Like, I think you're able to also look down the way... Okay, if, like, you see a, uh, a hole, then that's, like, back to the beginning, but if you don't see anything, that's good. Hey, how are you? What are you? Though you wear Kokiri-ish... Ugh, that's a word. Clothing. You can't fool me. I promised Saria I would never let anyone go through here. Okay, so, how do we prove it? Well, we probably just have to play her song. So, if I just remembered that song... <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing so bad with this. I'm usually not ever this bad. That's wrong. <laughs> Yay. There we go. Now, hopefully this works? It should? Yes, it does, okay. That melody. Zoria plays that song all the time. You, do you know Zoria? That song. Zoria taught that song only to her friends. Okay. I trust you. When I see you, I don't know why, but I remember him. That's descriptive. Alright, now... Okay. I actually see a light there. This way. So yeah, that's actually another way that you can get through here. Just follow... The, uh, except when they all have lights in them. That's bad. Okay, this one... I don't know if I'm going right. No, okay, that's nice. <laughs> like, it literally went until I found, like, a three-way path with all lights. That didn't help me this way. And I'm pretty sure I went this way? Yeah. Yeah, and there you are. But all three of these paths had... You had light, I saw- 
Okay, whatever. No, wait. I went forward and then all three paths have light. Except now? Okay. Oh, I got sent back to the beginning, didn't I? I'm pretty sure I just did. Hold on. Oh my goodness, this is frustrating. Um... I'm actually getting lost in this place. This is nice. This is nice. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Okay, I finally found out where to go after having to look it up. <sighs> Stupid. From here on, we'll be going through some... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Man, to be honest, that... That actually lowered my self-esteem. That's... That's nice. I kind of want to get back to the game, so Navi, if you could please shut up. There we go. Um, problem is, I need to be really careful, and for whatever reason, movement is not easy right now. Can I move over like a normal person? Why am I fidgeting slightly? Is that like the startup of it? Hold on. Why am I... Okay, whatever. All I know is that I pretty much... Like, I can be caught by these guys, but if I do, it's not gonna end well. So yeah, don't want to get caught. Oh my goodness, please turn around. And I mean, like, turn around as a 180. There we go. I did... Yay. Can you, like, leave so I can get out of the water, please? What in the- okay, fine. I quite literally no reason to turn around, but whatever. To be honest, I don't even care at this point. I just want to get through this area so that I can... And like, I have healing items, so I can just... Not worry about it too much, I think. I don't know if I'm able to actually get past this guy, though. Okay, no, I'm not. I actually do have to sneak around this guy. Or not. How this guy doesn't actually... Well... I'm pretty sure they don't actually, like, attack to their side, so I guess I'm good there. But yeah, I can't go yet because there's not... Oh, there is, like, grass here. Or you can turn around for quite literally no reason. And then I think I have to... No, I don't have to go here. Whoops. But I can get out of here early enough. There we go. There's a square here, which probably means there's uh, someone on the other side of here. Yay. Uh, okay, I think I can go this way. Yes, I can. Okay. My... Okay, I'm using a potion because I'm not dying. I don't even care if I have a fairy. I'm not wasting that. 
Oh, goodness, this area is dumb. Okay, what is this? Luckily, he can't, like, turn around for whatever reason. Time is always cruel. Its speed seems different for each person, but no one can change it. By the way, I don't remember the voice I made for you, which is awkward. A thing that doesn't change what it no, a thing that doesn't change what time is a memory of younger days. In order to come back here again, play the minuet of forest. You have learned the minuet of forest. Pit, I'll see you again. Man, just like that, Sheik is gone. And I'm not gonna lie, that is kind of how the rest of the, uh... It's kind of how Sheik most, most of the time is in this game, which is unfortunate. Uh, here. If I could aim. Oh my goodness, there's a red, there we go. There's a red dot whenever you can connect to it, so. Okay, I fell through the floor. Um, but I'm gonna wait until next episode to do this because, oh goodness, I'm frustrated now. And I think I might actually be able to save here. Hopefully, hopefully I can save here and it will just put me back in here. Don't know if it will though, unfortunately. So, until next video, take care.